Hi, I'm Maximus. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to upload custom images and pictures from photo mode. But before we start, this is for the Steam build only. And I will be doing this on Windows 11. So let's start with custom image. So the first thing you should do is create yourself a random picture. It could be anything. You could call it anything. I'm going to call these all tests on the canvas on the flags, on the billboards, and the signs. This will make sense a little bit later on while I'm doing this. So now we'll leave the game and we'll go to the Steam community page. I'll leave the link in the description below. And now we're going to scroll down to this download link and click it. Now you'll get a warning that you're leaving Steam. It's down to you whether you do or not. Now it should open up this Google Drive. Now at the time of this recording, you want to download version 1.5. There is a 1.6 there as a zip file, but it didn't work for me. So download version 1.5. You get a warning saying this file might be dangerous. Download it anyway. Again, do it at your own risk. Then Windows will then start warning you to click on more info and run anyway. So it's now downloaded and installed. And this is what we have. You have upload PNG to upload your custom pictures. You can select different colors. And then you can choose which structure you wish to paint on, which is a difference in size. For this showing, I'm going to go onto flag, which is 256 by 256. Now go to your preferred image software and resize the desired image to the size, in this case 256 by 256 for the flag. And make sure you save it as a PNG format. Upload it and then press convert to PNT and this time we're going to call it ASA right okay so there it is I've left it deliberately in download so I know exactly where it is and now we're going to move the image into the game so to do that you need to open your local drive go to program files steam steam apps common arc survival ascended shooter game saved and my paintings. Now we move the file in here. And now we've moved it over, you might have noticed we've only got the name. So now the reason why we created those test pictures, it has generated the extensions we need for our custom image. So this image was initially for the flag. I'm going to rename it from copying from the test flag we did earlier. And there you go, that's it. So we go back into the game. Now make sure you have the right dies. We'll let you go up to load paint, and there you can see ASA. Now you choose to load the painting. It can take a minute or two for it to load. And there you go, one custom image. And now for photo mode. Simply line up the angle you wish. In the menu, go to photo mode. And there's all sorts of options you can tweak. If you go all the way to the bottom, you can then choose how you want to save the picture. For this example, we're going to go flag again, name the file, and just like before, we go to the flag, load picture, and wait for it to load up again. And there's the flag on photo mode. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button. If you want more from me, press subscribe. If you want to stalk me, hit notifications. Cheers and gone.